the Bergen Catholic Crusaders put on the gold helmets one more time in 2017. It's the non-public Group 4 title game. Bergen needs to top St. Peter's for a second time this season. On the opening drive of the game, here's Johnny Langan to Tyler Devera, a 26-yard gain. The Crusaders are on the move just outside the red zone. An 11-play, 70-yard drive is capped off by Johnny Langan. He's in the zone for five yards out. Bergen Catholic takes a 7-0 lead. Langan was an absolute force. He ran with a purpose and set the physical tone that permeated throughout the entire Bergen Catholic roster. The Crusaders then go to the hook and lateral. Dylan Classy flips to Ramir Johnson, 13 yards into the zone. Bergen Catholic leads 14-0 at the end of one. Langan does such a good job of getting the whole roster involved. Here's Michael Feaster, great grab here. He's down to the 11-yard line. Bergen would have to settle for a Michael Carney field goal from 20 yards out, so it's the Crusaders with a 17-0 lead in the second quarter. Bergen Catholic had all the momentum, and they weren't even close to their peak. Here, the special teams unit comes up huge. Kate McDermott causes the fumble. Isaiah Gibbons recovers. So the Crusaders have awesome field position. Langan smells blood in the water and he strikes. Such a tough runner. Johnny Langan from six yards out, 24-0 Bergen. The future Boston College Eagle had a final high school game to remember. We'll remember this Bergen Catholic team for so many things, including being hard hitting. Javon Cruz, oh my goodness. Is that the hardest hit of the year from Bergen? It might be. And the Crusaders defense, they were also dialed in. Javante John Baptiste with the fumble. John high on the recovery. So the Crusaders get the ball at midfield with 109 to go in the half. And Bergen Catholic just kept pouring it on. Langan. This is a big time throw. Tyler Devera in the back of the end zone. Just three ticks on the clock. At the half, the Crusaders are flying high. It's 31 to nothing. There would be no drama at all in the second half. Bergen Catholic determined to put this game away. John Baptiste with the sack here. And then the knockout punch. We've got a fake punt. Anthony Corbin creating a memory at MetLife Stadium. Look at him go. 54 yards to the house. That made it 37-0. And Bergen Catholic has been waiting a long time to claim the trophy. And there it is. The Crusaders leave no doubt as to who is the top team in New Jersey in 2017. Simply a dominating performance at MetLife Stadium. 44-7 is your final. Johnny Langan had 117 yards through the air, 91 on the ground, two TD passes, two TD runs. Javante Jean-Baptiste, three sacks. Congratulations to head coach Nunzio Campanelli and his entire staff. It has been a real treat to bring you highlights from Oradell as the Crusaders always brought amazing highlights to Jersey Sports Zone. Alex Lorenzo joins us with post-game reaction from the non-public Group 4 state champions. Thanks a lot, Rich. Bergen Catholic captures its 17th state title in school history and its first since 2004 with a dominating 44-7 win over St. Peter's Prep. Head coach Nunzio Campanelli described it as the best performance he's seen in all of his eight years in Oradell. And after the game, I caught up with the Crusaders talking about the big state championship win. It's been a long time coming. Ever since I was a little kid and my dad told me about the state championship, he won at Bergen and uh, I just wanted to do the same thing. And I've been saying it for a very long time and I finally accomplished my number one goal. We have a bunch of guys that will big uh, that will step up in a big time situation, and uh, that's that, that's a championship team. That's what they're made of. It's, it's amazing. It's a it's a blessing. Any high schooler that's on his senior year could only wish for bringing a state championship home, and that's what we did. Uh, well, coming to this game, we knew we had to set the tone, and we just said if both sides do, does what what they have to do, it will be a game, and we put on the show. It just feels amazing right now. It's been a long time coming for this state title. I think that we've earned every single bit of it. You know, all, starting all the way from July to now. You know, we've built with, we've dealt with a lot of adversity. We've overcome a lot, and you know, to just win tonight in the fashion that we did, I don't think words can put that into uh, description. Congratulations to Bergen Catholic High School for winning the non-public Group Four state championship. Reporting from MetLife Stadium, I'm Alex Lorenzo with Jersey Sports Zone. Want to see highlights and features from your favorite school? 
Jersey Sports Zone is entirely supported by our great sponsors. Email marketing at jerseysportszone.com to get your business in front of our loyal audience and highlights from your hometown.